the Dubai Gold Cup is next. And this one should be over a bit of a trip. Two miles, in fact, Group 2. And four year olds are not much the top one. It's Cabo Zarad for Darren Thompson. Crucian Tutsi for David Robertson. Desert Hobo. Craig Beckwith. Destinatus. Jim Murray. Houston Obsessive for Vinnie Gerard. Jammer Cottage. James Shea. Quick Pond. Leon Van Rensburg. Shergar. Ryan Costello. Aphrodite. Joshua Sutherland. Give me some candy. Craig Allen. Happy Hawk. Dan Hughes. Late Night Martin Cairns. Memphis. David Hooley. And Star Deli. Alex Cherry. They're all in and ready to go. And off they go. And two miles a trip this time. Cabo Zarad looks like he might be one of the first to show, but Houston Obsessive has gone through it. Looks like Vinnie Jarrett's got the front wheel in trunk throughout his entire stable, I think. As Houston Obsessive has now quickly gone into a three length lead. Cabo Zarad is second, then Aphrodite and Destinatus. Looks like Jim Murray's going with the Roman theme or something this season, and it's Houston Obsessive who's gone five clear from Aphrodite in second, then Cabo Zarad, Destinatus, and a gap after that to Happy Hawk, and they're already quite well spread out here, and Houston Obsessive is setting a pretty stiff pace as they come up past the stand and past the, the big screen and the winning post with a complete circuit to go, of course, and... Houston Obsessive is the leader. In fact, there might be two complete circuits to go. I'm not sure how big this track is. Aphrodite is second, then Destinators is third, Cabo Zarad is fourth, and then Crucian Tuts in. Give me some candies after that one. Star Deli is also there as well, looking towards the back. Late night is just about the back marker, but it's Houston Obsessive who's clearing the lead by a good five lengths to Aphrodite in second. Then comes Destinators on the inside in third. Capo Zarad is fourth. Gap of two or three lengths then to the grey Crucian Tootsie. The yellow and green hoops of Give Me Some Candy with Star Deli and the orange sleeves on the inside of that one. Um, also in that little pack at the back there you can see Quick Pond in the dark blue with a yellow cap. That one's going to need to get going a little bit soon. So too is Memphis in the purple jacket wide on the outside of the fancied ones. With Houston Obsessive who's clear. By about four lengths to Aphrodite in second, Destinators and Capo Zara. That's been the order pretty much throughout so far. Crucian Tootsie leads the chasing pack with Happy Horton. Give me some candy. Memphis is now starting to make a bit of a forward move on the outside. And Quick Pond is trying to get going on the inside. But it's Houston Obsessive who's still two and a half clear as they pass the seven furlong pole with Capo Zara in second. Aphrodite third, Destinators fourth. Gap of a few lengths then back to Crucian Tootsie and Quick Pond. And then Jamma Cottage and Memphis give me some candies after that one. But it's still Houston Obsessive who's in the lead, but now about to be joined by Cabo Zarad. Houston Obsessive in the green, Cabo Zarad in the white sleeves. Then comes Aphrodite and Destinators. Gap then of four lengths now back to Jamma Cottage and Crucian Tootsie. Memphis is trying to get going on the outside of the track. Quick Pond still trying to get up the inside as well. But it's Houston Obsessive who's kicked on again in the lead, passing the full furlong pole. It's Houston Obsessive by a length and a half to Cabo Zarad in second. Then Aphrodite, Destinators, Crucian Tootsie now started to get going. So too Quick Pond and Memphis. Jamma Cottage after that one. Give me some candies also trying to get into it. But it's Houston Obsessive past the three, still in the lead by two from Cabo Zarab. Aphrodite, Crucian Tootsie is looking a big danger. Here comes Quick Pond on the outside and also wider still Memphis. But it's still Houston Obsessive on the run into the final two. They go and it's Houston Obsessive, Aphrodite, Quick Pond, Memphis. Quick Pond now beginning to try and get a money outside. But Houston Obsessive has got the run and doesn't want to be denied. It's Houston Obsessive into the final furlong and now finally Quick Pond hits the front. But Houston Obsessive is battling back. It's Quick Pond now. A certain Quick Pond is now racing away towards the line. Destinators is finishing like an absolute train. Now Quick Pond needs the line, and Destinators is stolen it on the line. Destinators gets up for Jim Murray and steals it from Quick Pond. And Jim Murray took one of the sprints earlier, and now he's taken a long distance one as well. So I think we can quite safely say that Jim Murray's back in the big time. And um, a good win there for Destinators for Jim Murray. Quick Bond is second for Leon Van Rensburg. Give me some candy. Craig Allen was fourth. Desert Hobo for Craig Beckley was fifth. And Cabo Zarad for Darren Thompson was fifth. And then Houston Obsessive only ended up sixth after looking like he was probably going to win inside the far half furlong.